we put together an expedition taking four wounded servicemen with us. Uh, the great thing was at the time, everyone in the Polar community said it couldn't be done. I believe in the roads where I belong. I was born to walk along to the end. We all live our lives with goals and dreams. You know, I could still accomplish all my dreams. I was in Iraq, a place called Yusufia. I was on a rooftop. Uh, mortar round landed uh, to my to my right, about 100 meters away, and then the next one landed five feet to my left, uh, killing um, killing two guys in my unit, rendering me severely injured and blind. So out of all my injuries, the blindness is the one that is a permanent damage. This bracelet right here is uh, Ralph Porus, Sergeant, Sergeant Ralph Porus. And so he died that same day right next to me on a rooftop. You know, everywhere I go, I carry Ralph, Ralph with me. And every race I do, he's, he's with me. He's with me all stepping away. And so, you know, every night I pray for his family, his kids. We all have goals, you know, like my goal was to be a SF team leader. When you're told that you're blind, you have no clue. You you don't have information. You don't know, you know, what can a, someone that's visually impaired, someone that's blind, what can he do? Ivan Castro is a phenomenal athlete and he's an inspirational guy and he's, he's not a quitter. Well, you can't hold me down. You can't stop these things I do. Cause the road it holds the truth to who I am And the seasons turn And I set off to the sky Well I know that I'm alive Cause it's just me to Iraq and got hurt, man. There's definitely guys out there that are having a bigger battle than I do. You know, I don't think my story's all that. You know, I, I just choose not to quit, you know. 